Hello guys, welcome to this tutorial. Before we get started, I want to let you know that you can find all the code examples and resources we'll be using today in the GitHub repository linked in the video description below. This repository serves as a valuable companion to the tutorial, allowing you to follow along, experiment, and explore the code on your own time. I'm Samuel Giampieri, and I'm a freelance developer. Join my community by subscribing to my channel at Divergolabs. Explore a wealth of coding content and free courses on my website. Divergolabs.com. The next house involves a four-step procedure to, to install it and integrate to our project. So the, the first step is the installation by NPN. And after installation, you can configure the uh, authentication provider settings in your Next.js application. So the next step is to add an API route uh, and uh, internally next auth detects that is being initialized in a route handler. It actually understand that it's passed as a web request instance and it will return an handler that as a response instance we will see that there is a, a simple in initialization and an advanced one where you can change in details or all, all the logics under the hood the third step is to configure the shared se session state so we have to wrap up our application in a session provider so in this way uh, the next hot will manage all the session during the navigation of, of the user. And the fourth step is to integrate the, the, the front-end code. So we, we have to add a React hook that is called use session to, uh, to manage, to check if our user is, um, is, con is uh, authenticated or not. So let's start with the first step, the installation. So you can see I already connected to my server in actually is in, in AWS, it's an EC2. We already have our our Next.js tutorial project that it include all the all the page and all the material that you can see in my YouTube channel and in a specific chapter of Next.js. For this special tutorial for Next Auth, I want to create a new project. I, I can also create a specific GitHub repo. I already installed, of course, Node.js, and I'm going to create. Uh, a second project. So you, we already saw in the previous chapter that to create a new project, we can use npx create next app latest, and we can call it a next how tutorial. Then create next app. We proceed the same procedure that we saw before. We're going to use uh, upscript, TypeScript uh, as lint and win. We don't know source, source directory. We use app router. We don't need import alias. And here we go. We have a new project that is called Next All Tutorial. This is it's installing all the dependencies. We'll wait a little bit. Almost done. Here we go. We create a new project. We go inside this new folder. Next. Hold. We want to uh, locally install the next house. So to install the next house, we have to to digit npm install the next house. You can use also other package manager like Yarn. In this way, we use npm, of course, because it's uh, already integrated in the, in our project. So if we go inside the package JSON, we see. We have uh, all the dependencies that we need for this project. We have uh, Next Health, actually, is the latest version that is dot uh, is for dot twenty three dot two. We have React. All the other de dependencies has been installed by Next.js, React DOM, React, and everything that we need. So we install the Next Auth, so we are ready to go to the further steps. We have reached the end of this video tutorial and I genuinely hope you have enjoyed its content. If it has been helpful to you, please show your support by liking the video and sharing it with your friends on social media. If you haven't already, I warmly invite you to subscribe to my channel to stay updated on upcoming lessons. Don't forget to check out my website, thevergolabs.com, where you will find a plethora of interesting programming content. You can also send me collaboration requests and explore all the programming services we offer. Your participation and support are crucial in my growing 
and to grow this community and providing you with even more valuable resources. Thank you for the bottom of my heart for being here with us and I look forward to seeing you in the next video tutorial.